friends, I'm Pastor Diana. Welcome to another Daily Devotion. Thank you so much for joining me as we wrap up our theme of living a compassionate life and loving like God. We've explored how we do this by doing justice, walking humbly with God, welcoming others, encouraging others, and showing mercy and basic loving kindness to those who we might even consider our enemy. So how do we continue to live a compassionate life? Well, we serve others. Because when we serve others, we are serving God. This is summed up in Jesus's parable uh, called the parable of the sheep and goats found at the end of Matthew. So I'm gonna pick up at verse 34. Then the king will say to those on his right, come you who will receive good things from my father, inherit the kingdom that was prepared for you before the world began. I was hungry and you gave me food to eat. I was thirsty and you gave me a drink. I was a stranger and you welcomed me. I was naked and you gave me clothes to wear. I was sick and you took care of me. I was in prison and you visited me. Then those who are righteous will reply to him, Lord, when did we see you hungry and feed you or thirsty and give you a drink? When did we see you as a stranger and welcome you or naked and give you clothes to wear? When did we see you sick or in prison and visit you? And the king will reply, I assure you that when you have done it for the least of these brothers and sisters of mine, you have done it for me. Why do we show compassion? Because when we show compassion, when we see the suffering of others and take action to alleviate it, we are loving like God and we are loving God, because the people around us, God is in them. And so when we see that they are suffering and we take actions through justice or basic needs or making sure that uh, they feel welcomed or encouraged or they have the things that they need or bringing about peace, then we are loving God. You know, sometimes we talk about this of seeing the face of Jesus in everyone we meet. And that is hard, but living a compassionate life calls us to serve others, even when it is hard, calls us to see God in others and take action to make sure that others' suffering is alleviated. Can we solve all the problems? Probably not, but this world would be a little bit better, a lot better actually, if we treated everyone with loving compassion, living a compassionate life, and loving them like God loves them and us too. Will you pray with me? Gracious and loving God, thank you for your love for me and your compassion for me. Help me to see you in the face of everyone I meet so that I can extend that love, your love in your name to them and love you in return. Amen. Thank you so much for exploring with me what it means to live a compassionate life. Feel free to, subs uh, to comment below or subscribe to the YouTube channel so that you don't miss next week's. I hope that you have a wonderful day.